really going gray. it's your girl Tyra and I'm back with a weekly vlog I woke up the other day and I was like you know what I think I want to start weekly vlogging so that's exactly what I'm doing today is Monday I don't have anything planned for real all I know is I want to take these braids out because I did some knotless braids like two weeks ago and they have seen better days so they have to come out today they have to that's that's the one thing that I know for sure that I'm going to do today. We take these braids out right now. We are not waiting. My first time doing knotless braids. I think I did pretty good. I did not record it, but I am planning on doing them again next week. So I will record it when I do them again. Yeah, I'm going to get the video, so don't worry. But yeah, doing knotless braids all by myself. That's why I didn't do them all by myself. My mom did the parts. She snapped on the parts and my boyfriend helped feed in the hair while I braided. But you know, next time, I think I'm ready to attempt it all by myself. Maybe with a little bit of hope, I don't know. If you're wondering, I have love and braids. Since my hair is so long, my hair basically stops at the rubber band. So it's no, it's no cutting up here for me. So yeah, we're just gonna. Say goodbye to the braids. They, they served me well, but it's time for them to go. Oh my gosh, child. I don't know why I decided to throw on this fleece roll. I'm hot. I'll be bad because this is, I can't, I can't. I honestly didn't even plan on doing all this braids. I originally was going to do twists, but after the test, after doing the test twist, I was like, mm, I don't think I'm going to do this anymore. Let's try knotless. And the knotless braids came out good, if I'm going to say so myself. I'll insert, a, I'll insert a clip of what the braids looked like the first day I did them. So I can get a better idea of how they look. One of the things I need to work on with doing my own braids, adding in, adding in the hair because I really don't have that down and tucking my hair better because even though it's the same color, I want my hair to be better protected inside the braid. So yeah, you yeah. gotta work on that. It's been about 30 minutes since I last picked up the camera. I thought I was going to, you know, take just a little break and then wash my hair and everything but i have a slight headache and i don't know why i feel like it's because i look at screens so much so i either need to well i do need to limit my screen time it is prime day amazon prime day um i ordered one thing so far i think i'm gonna check to see if they have any like blue light glasses because that might help with looking at screens so often. Oh, these are not cute. So I probably won't order any from Amazon because these ain't it. I want something, I want some cute turf. Yeah. These just look like your regular Dacula glasses. I need some a little, little bit more, a little bit more jazzy. Those are kind of cute, but I don't think I want to spend twenty dollars on some glasses. So it's the next day. It's Tuesday or whatever. And as y'all can tell, I didn't do my hair yesterday. Monday was just a very, very slow day. Like that headache, it just threw my whole day off. So I ain't much. But I'm doing my hair now. And my scalp does not look bad at all. Like the last time I washed my hair was like three and a half weeks ago. I kept the braids in for like two weeks. And then I had my hair in chunky twists with my own hair. 
for like one week. And yeah, so that's like three and a half weeks, whatever. But my scalp does not look bad at all. If you watch my last video, y'all can see my scalp was looking a little crazy. And that was like three weeks without washing my hair. And this is three weeks without washing my hair. And it doesn't look how it looked in the last video. And those my thoughts beautiful products are honestly the truth. Like I've been reaching for them every time I want to wash my hair after that video. Like I was sleeping on those products, but I woke now. It just looks so good. Like it doesn't itch. It's not a snowstorm, of course. It's like it's a little dirty, you know. It's been three weeks, but it looks good yeah if y'all can't tell i really like those products i like them so much that i went and i spent my own coin because that video was sponsored but y'all know i keep it real but yeah i spent my own money on the products because they are that good they are that girl that product that brand and i saw them on curlbox and i love me some curlbox because y'all know i'm all about saving a little coin and they had their other collection, so this little curl box or whatever. Black is beautiful, period. 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 Like, the only product that I used out of here was the edge control. It's, it's a decent edge control. How about skin with a shampoo, conditioner? Um, deep conditioner and a curl cream and an edge control that I've been using like I said so I'll probably take that for a spin. I know my hair isn't that tangled but they were in braids for two weeks so I do need to get the shed hair out so I'm gonna do that before I wash it. I don't know if I'm gonna detangle with just water or if I'm gonna use a product. I think I'm used to product. I'll be ready. I remember like Tyra, why you got that big old box? But if you're unaware, last year I did a photo shoot for Dark and Lovely and it was for their new protective style line. I could have gotten rid of the box, but I don't know, just, it's just, this, this package means a lot to me. So I just keep the products in the box. Ooh. Ooh. Child, this box is too heavy for me to be carrying it like this, but. So I'm going to use the detangling cream from the collection. <laughs> this was the product that was the focal point of like my part of the shoot, so yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna just use this. I'm gonna detangle my hair in the sections, in the braid sections that they're in. I love the way these products smell. I'll use a little bit of this detangling cream. Yeah, I still got braid in here, my hair. With my new favorite detangling brush, the Felicia Leatherwood detangling brush, I'm just going to. Detangle my hair. Little water ain't never hurt nobody. Work it in. I'm done using this product, it's going right back into my little display box. That's what I'm doing my hair. Let's just talk about hair. Um, I did dye my hair. 
I want to say I dyed my hair jet black in February. It was just a little semi-permanent dye. I did record that video. If y'all still want to see it, I will post it. But yeah, I dyed my hair jet black. The color done washed out already. And I think I'm going to do it again. Like, jet black hair just hits different. I don't know if I'm going to um, use permanent dye, even though I really like the look of jet black hair. And I don't think I would ever like dye my hair another color. I'm just like, I don't think I'm going to do it because I'm like, what if I do want to dye my hair another color? Because jet black is just a pain, I heard, to like remove if you want to go lighter. So, I don't know. I, in the back of my mind, I want to do a skunk stripe. I just think it's so cute, but I feel like I'm going to get tired of it in like a week and regret doing it. So, I'm going to just keep my natural hair color for a little bit. And yeah. I don't know. Shower. I can't get over how good my scalp looks. Like, oh my gosh, y'all probably tired of hearing me say it, but my scalp was being problematic and it's finally acting right. And I feel like that's due to the products that I have been using. So I'm back. My hair is all detangled. Honestly, it didn't take too long. I'm about to wash my hair. I think. I kind of want to try the new products that I bought from My Black is Beautiful. I think I'm going to just use the Blue Ginger because those products have been working really good in my hair. So, I don't know. And I do need to clarify. So, um, I think I'm going to use the Blue Ginger Shampoo, follow up with the Fortifying Golden Milk Conditioner, and then use the intensive treatment, golden milk, whatever. I think I'm gonna do that. So I'll let y'all know how I like everything once I get off the shower and maybe I will try this conditioning cream because I think I'm gonna do a twist out. Yeah, I am gonna do a twist out. It's Thursday, it is late in the day, and this is what happened. So I was editing the clips, and I was like, this sounds off. And I knew my camera had fell off while it makes the French toast, but I didn't think anything of it. I'm like, it's fine, it's still working, but 
the audio just sounded like I was under, underneath water for the clips after I made the bread soaps. So yeah, I thought my camera was broken. I was ready to buy a new camera. And I was like, you know what, let me, let me try to do something. And I did it and my camera is now fixed. The audio should be back to normal. But yeah, I don't think I'm gonna use any of the clips that I filmed because they just sound so horrible. There were some good clips, but I'll just summarize what happened. So Wednesday, I went to Target. I did a little mini Target haul and a little mini Amazon haul because I did get one of my packages that I ordered on Prime Day. So that audio was bad. And then I think I vlogged a little bit more, but that audio was obviously bad too. So that was yesterday. And today, the clips that were messed up, I might insert some of them because it was some good footage. But um, yeah, I was just talking about like breakfast and you know, my plans for today, blah, 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 blah. And then some sneakers dropped on the sneakers app. And I was basically saying how I hit like the other week on the varsity greens. And then my last hit was the Syracuse high dunks. And yeah, sneakers app wasn't letting me hit for like over a year. And then I finally hit on the dunks and then I had to get on the dunks. And today I hit again. <laughs> Two pair of sneakers dropped today, the University Blue Dunks and the Neutral Gray One Lows. And I hit on one low, so I'm gonna just insert that clip because I like that footage. Oh. all day because whenever I don't think about what you talking about all day <laughs> I did try for all the sneakers like I had two chances to hit on the neutral grades because he dropped in women's and he dropped in grade school so I tried for a five and a half and a four and I had a four so you know I saved thirty dollars because grade school is always cheaper than you know the bigger sizes but yeah I didn't hit on the university blues I wasn't really trying for myself because I already have the coast on yeah I took out my twist. The twist out came out decent. You know, it's cute. I think it's cute. I my bangs have gotten very long. Like I'm sure y'all saw how the bottom was just wasn't looking right. So I might cut the front pieces just a little just so it frames my face a little better. So instead of making y'all listen to the bad audio clip of the Amazon Target haul, I'll just show y'all what I got since I got another package and yeah, oh, the first thing I got was this shower caddy I was gonna buy one the other week but I was like you know what let me wait because it might go on sale and this wasn't the original one that I was gonna get I was gonna get a black metal but I ended up just getting silver because I think it goes better with my bathroom but yeah it came in a two-pack I gave my mom one and you know something simple then yesterday got some gel nail polishes because I am obsessed with nails. I have been for a while, but over the past few months I've just been, you know, making some press on ones that has been very therapeutic for me. I really like the Beatles brand, so I got a six pack. This is the Mint Mojito pack. The colors, so cute. And then today I got the other polishes. Let's see what this one is. <sighs> they have white tops. I don't remember the name of this six pack, but the colors are very pretty. I like, I like, I like. Okay, back to this one. This might be, did I get a neon pack? Wait, I know what I know what one this is. I know which one this is. I think this has like the reds and yup. 
Because <laughs> ah. I don't really have any red gel nail polishes, and these are on sale for like $7.99. Yup. And I got another base and top coat. Got an SD card, 256 gigabytes, because I'm gonna be pushing out these videos, so I needed some more SD cards. I never have enough SD cards. I got some poly mailers. Oh yeah, that's what I was talking about um, in one of the clips that were bad. I was talking about how I need to go through my clothes because I do want to start selling my clothes again on Depop. So yeah, I needed some mailers to ship them in. So I got these. And I got some more heads to my electric toothbrush. I used the Oral-B one if you're wondering, but... And last, I got some nail tips because I do not have this style. Ooh, these are very, 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 very long. I might make a set with these tonight. Yo, I I really underestimated how long these nails were gonna be. But look. So comparing the longest nail shape that I have, with this new set like look at look at how much longer that is so it's the next day it is friday and i'm gonna go out today i'm gonna go out and i will vlog i mean i'm just going to the store i'm gonna go to ikea because i need to get a duvet cover i was waiting for the one that was on sale to go back in stock but i'm tired of waiting so i'm gonna just pay the extra five dollars to get the one that's in stock and um I don't know. I might get something else from Ikea. I'll see when I get there. Yeah, I'll probably leave the house in like, I don't know, 10 minutes. Find my sunscreen. Two fingers worth of sunscreen. That's how much sunscreen you should be using. Black girl sunscreen. If you know, you know. It should look like you have on a mask when you're applying sunscreen. And don't forget that neck. So... The sunscreen really makes you look like a glazed donut. And it's no white cast, so we love her. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> I just found a gray hair! That is not funny! <laughs> look at that! You see it? Almost! It's sticking up! Is that mine? Or is that that's mine? Yeah, that's yours. Hit that bird. <laughs> we finna go. <laughs> we finna go to Home Nemo because supposedly they have Tide on sale for like free. Yeah, basically free. So we finna go in there and see what it's setting on. Then we gonna go to Costco. It must have been right there, right there. That John gone. We should have went last night. Hair stuff. Uh, what? Oh my gosh. Okay, but don't didn't you need a mirror? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I'm helping. I'm helping you out. I just found you with a mirror that you wanted. You think these shower caps gonna fit on my hair? <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, get one of those little jobs. I need me a shower cap. These are cute. I know, right? These are really cute. Hmm. Oh, snap. Look, they got a little crochet tool. Oh, God. Wow. And my camera is about to die, but we are going to Costco with no list and just vibes. We will let Costco tell us what we need. We're going to see if they have this, this girl's fiddle plant. Ugh. Wait for me. So we're back from Costco. And we, we, why are you looking like that? Why are you looking at me like that? We ain't going 
go too crazy. Got me some Jimmy Dean turkey sausage. Activia yogurt because I'm currently obsessed. I got some mango Pepsi that we're gonna try soon. You gonna try it, right? I guess. Got some mango Pepsi. They had these really nice towels for five dollars. Real plush, real nice, real luxurious. So I got two of them. Got some golden kiwis because I'm also obsessed with these. And then for my Kia, we only got three things. Got the duvet cover that I was talking about earlier. Some bamboo straws because, you know, we're sustainable around here. And I got a metal bowl because I like metal bowls. And that's it. So I'm just hopping on here real quick because I got two more packages. I did end up ordering a pair of blue light glasses and they came today. Packaging is real cute. Glasses bag, little glasses cleaner. I think they're really cute. Um, I also got a PR package from e.l.f. This is my first PR package from home. So this is what the package looks like. It is their new putty primer, Acne Fighting. Um, a clean formula with a potent punch of 1.8% salicylic acid. Okay. Um, the OG Poreless Putty Primer, a brush. They say it's a putty primer brush, but I'll probably use it for something else. And they have some new putty bronzers. Okay. Wow. Look at that, Elf sending me a PR package. I've been using Elf since middle school and I'm in my 20s now, so I've used Elf for a long time. Roasted broccoli made in the air fryer. Bone apple tea. Dinner is served. 